course, it's very important to make the world more flood resilient. But there's another challenge we have to face. Rapidly increasing shortages of fresh water worldwide. Compared to flooding, lack of fresh water is perhaps less manifest, but it's equally urgent. So we think we should bring as well solutions that guarantee sufficient fresh water. For this, underground storage is a perfect option. Simple, sustainable, nature friendly, provided that it is designed properly and that water quality is adequate. We will show you in this video. A large part of Dutch tap water comes from main rivers, canals and lakes. First this surface water is treated at the intake and then it's pumped to areas where it replenishes groundwater. Most of these sites are along our North Sea coast where enough fresh groundwater is lacking. This is the Amsterdam dune system. Already for seven decades we have been infiltrating river water here to balance our groundwater extractions. Why do we do this? Well, first to maintain the wetlands and to prevent intrusion from seawater and to keep the balance of fresh water in the system. And secondly, to keep water in store in case the source is polluted or simply not accessible. And thirdly, to make this infiltrated river water resemble groundwater, which is still the best source for drinking water because of its constant quality and lack of pathogens. Large open reservoirs would be an alternative, but storage in the subsurface has definite advantages. First, it's better protected against pollution and also algae blooms do not occur underground. Underground water does not evaporate and most of all, passage through the subsurface turns the infiltrated water into a safe source. It frees it from the pathogens and ensures a much more constant quality and temperature than surface water, which in turn simplifies its final treatment to drinking water. This is where the water enters the site, almost continuously. 2,000 liters every second, 115 million liters per day. From here the water flows to the basins behind me and there it infiltrates at a rate of 20 centimeters per day. You want to know what the whole system looks like? We will give you a bird's eye view. This is an aerial view of the system, very close to the sea. It has 40 infiltration basins and a total area of 85 hectares, in which we infiltrate 55 million cubic meters per year. And recovery is with open canals and galleries that are installed in between the basins. Even if infiltration is stopped, due to which basins fall dry, extraction can continue for more than two months. This way we safeguard our drinking water supply. Artificial recharge requires some space, but the area can have other attractive functions as well. Nature conservation, nature education, and some types of recreation like walking, running, cycling. The Netherlands gained a lot of experience with subsurface storage, and this is what we think is key. First of all, much attention for water quality. Secondly, a suitable subsurface and predictable behavior of the water in it. And finally, integration in landscape and ecology. This is the message we hope you take home. Subsurface storage is the perfect option to stop shortages of fresh water. The concept is simple, solid, safe, sustainable and nature friendly provided that the water quality is adequate. So if you see a possibility, please let us know and we will come running to assist you. Thank you for watching.